so recently i got a comment about how to save uh, data internet data while playing the valorant valorant uses up to 250 megabytes of data per hour or about 200 megabytes per average length game data use fluctuates based on whether or not you use voice chat the number of players left in the game the tick rate of the game server and your client updates rate now here's few steps you can perform to save your internet data. Limit background bandwidth for Windows updates basically. You can also disable Windows updates that's more better option. Temporary you can disable these features just go into the Windows icon or search bar. Click on the search bar and then search here for services. Once you open the services simply you need to find here the Windows update just select any service and press W until you will get here the Windows update. Just double tap on it and startup app should be disabled hit apply and ok the alternative method is you can just click on the windows icon settings then go into the settings once you are here update and security and then advanced option now uncheck all these options and then click on delivery optimization by default this option is turned on just turn it off then again click on advanced option now once you are here you need to select here the limit how much bandwidth is used for download updates in the background and also check the foreground option and you can choose here 0 0.1 0 0.1 or you can go with the second option percentage of measured bandwidth check these both options and reduce it up to 5% also check these options upload bandwidth and just reduce it that's how you can manage your windows uh, use your internet and that's it now once you have done this the second option is lower in game graphic settings lowering graphic settings can reduce the amount of data transmitted as favored details need to be sent and received what you can do here open your game first and then go into the settings now go into the general first choose here up input buffer turn on the map settings depends on your opinion in my case mostly i use it on fixed based on side and then turn it off keep player centered and also you can turn off mini map vision cones right and if you scroll down a bit there's a few things show mature content just turn it off instability indicator just turn it off network buffering on minimum show bullet tracer turn it off show spectator counts that's not impacting on your internet but you can turn it off as well show players key bind on minimap just turn it off and that's it now go into the video settings once you are here you need to nvidia reflex low latency just turn it off graphic qualities make low as possible now go into the stats and make sure don't use stats just hide every single thing and that's it all right number three turn off voice chat disabling voice chat can save a significant amount of data what you can do here again go into the settings once you are here go into the audio and then go into the voice chat now simply you can turn off the voice chat that's it number four play shorter games more like engage in game modes like spy crush swift play team deathmatch and deathmatch which are shorter and use less data per session swift play spike deathmatch escalation and of course team deathmatch turn off background programs close any unnecessary background programs that might be consuming bad with such as Valorant tracker tools or other network intensive applications. What you can do here, just click on the icon, upper icon on the taskbar and just close any extra program that can consume your internet. And that's it. By following these steps, you can reduce the amount of data Valorant uses, helping you manage your internet bandwidth more effectively. See you in the next video. Until then, just take yourself. Allah Hafiz. Bye-bye.